Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another How To Minecraft episode with Lachlan. Yeah, buddy, that's right. And uh, what do we have for everyone today, Jerome? Well, pretty much this episode, we're going to take a look at some of the cooler parts of Minecraft in the potion world. So, Lachlan's going to walk us through that. We're going to set up a nice little potion room at my place, as well as just go over certain types of simple potions and how we can make them. Yep, yep, yep. So, uh, since uh, there's been a couple updates to potions lately, but the big two uh, in updates for potions so far has been the water breathing potion and the jumping potion, uh, at least from the last time I started Throwing potions, I guess. Uh, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I've got some nether warts for Jerome as well because little Jerome had no nether warts and they were all taken, weren't they, Jerome, by the time you got to the nether fortress? Yeah, so. all the nether warts are kind of gone from the first fortress and I assume all the other ones as well. So, Locke is here to help us. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. And I also do want to preface as well that if I am echoing just a little bit, I do apologize. We're trying our best to try and fix the echo, but uh, the, we don't know where to get foam. We tried. We tried getting foam today. We couldn't find any stores that sold it, so we're going to hopefully find some tomorrow. Uh, but I have fixed this little uh, little render bug that I have with my audio, so that's fixed. But, uh, you know, moving in has been a little hectic, so uh, it's been uh, it's been something, hasn't it, Jerome? It's been something. Yeah, it's been an adventure, but, you know, we're getting there. Slowly but surely we are, and, uh, yeah, so just bear with us while we do. Mm -hmm. But, uh, Lachlan, so what do we exactly need? for today's little uh, fun. Ooh. Bit of fun. Well, for fun, fun, fun. I've got all the ingredients over here. I'm right next to you, by the way. That's a sick looking Betty I got there, buddy. That's a sick oh, looking Betty. Thank you, Betty. kind sir. I'm just killing off villagers I don't really need. Oi, fish, fish. Why are you killing them? That's a bit rude. Well, there's there's too many. Choke will warn me they'll crash the server if I let too many spawn. I think I have a rude sandstorm up. Oi, fish, fish, fish. When's your How to Minecraft episode coming out tonight? When is it coming out? <laughs> Boom! Oh! oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! He scared what? the hell out of me! Oh my god! Hashtag how to Minecraft prank! Oh my god! A big prank! Big prank! Oh no! Not the big prank! Not oh even no. diamonds though. Mitch, can you help me find the diamonds? Real quick? No, I actually thought I was. Did you hear me coming in or what? Yeah, yeah I heard you coming oh, in. Oh, the front door does the little. Yeah, thing. so. Alright, I got you. I got you. Alright, Jerome. Are you gonna are you gonna learn how to brew some potions, Mitch? Brew some potions. Yeah, we're gonna teach you how to yeah, brew some potions. potions. Alright, so let's brew some potions. Alright, we got our tables up. So, uh, where do we want to set this up, Jerome? Uh, well, I'm guessing, how much room do we need for this? Um, we need a decent amount of room. Let's just build, I got, I got a bit of, like, orange and... Ooh, nice head. Thanks. I know, right? It's pretty cool. Jerome gave it to me, actually. <laughs> pretty sick. Um, let's build it over here, Jerome. Just up, up near our creeper farm, you know what I'm saying? So we can, like, AFK make potions, and then hopefully get lightning on creepers as well. Why okay, I like that idea. I like that a lot. I'm gonna close to some wood as well, just I'm we can use for it. Using my Betty axe. And now, hello? unmuting Skype. Have fun. Uh, hello? Okay. I didn't know hey. that, that was the hotkey for that. Don't worry, buddy. Don't worry, buddy. Don't worry, buddy. Let's keep on going. Let's keep on going. You all good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I just had a little bit of an issue with my audio, but it's hopefully it's oh, fine. Oh, for a second I thought the internet went out in the house. So I was it's, like, it's fixed uh... now. It's fixed. All right. Um, anyway, come over here. Come over here. Come over here. All right. All right, you got it, buddy. Let's, yeah, so we'll build it near our charge creeper. Also, I want to show a couple things in our, in our car, in our charge, eh, charge creeper farm. I got another creeper in there, and uh, yeah. Ooh. Yep. I caught really? One. Yeah, yeah, I caught one because I did Vic strat where you try to catch him up and then bring him up. I've also got a name tag if you want to try and catch another one, uh, but don't get too close like always because we might uh, we might get in a little bit of trouble, you know. All right, so come up here. Have a look All at right, our I'm coming. I'm a coming. Okay. I'm a coming to check out the creepers. So look at the creepers. Got baby creeper. You got another crepper. No, let me see the creepers. There's a crepper. Where'd you go? I'm, I'm coming right here. Jerome? Why'd you go that way? That's a loser way. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so two creepers. So we can make like a little house over here. This is, it'll be like a potion room and, oh, Jerome. Yeah. It's raining. Are they going to blow up if I walk on them? No, no, no. Only if you open up the thing. So don't open up the thing. Then we just need two more slots for two other creepers because that's what we got name tags for. So I've got a name How tag. How'd you do this? You're a genius. Look, it's what I do. It's what I do, all right? <laughs> That's what I do. Alright, anyway, let's build a little little hut for us to make some potions at. So, I've got some clays. Uh, where do you think we should build? I feel like we should do it inside, like, and keep these in in-house creeper farms. I don't know. What do you think? Nah. nah. Let's, let's, build, let's build a little, let's build a, for like, a potion house, like, right around here. Okay. I, I can lay the groundwork down. Don't worry, don't worry. Alright, I reckon right here. Do you have any dirt to fill this in? It's a little bit I got wood planks so we can make wood. Yeah. All right. yeah, yeah, put a wood floor down. Put a wood floor. Yeah, yeah, nice, nice, nice. And they'll do like a red, sort of like uh, a red stained clay, like outside. Look yeah, really how much red stained clay do you have? I like a stack in a bit, so, you know, enough. Um, just dig okay. out the sides. This should be, it should work. It'll be a nice little cool potion house, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, there we go. We're, we're symmetrical now. We're hip. 
And this is like also at the same time being like a little bit of a truce. Because we're going to use these potions when uh, push comes to shove, you know what I mean? If we don't have potions... <gasps> HOLY CRAP! Wow, you actually scared him that time. Jeez, man! I couldn't prank Jerome because his door is locked. Oh, what a buzzkill! Damn! Why you do well, this, Jerome? Why are you doing well, of course this? I'm going to lock my door, actually, right? <laughs> what? Can I lock that door? What? Can I lock that door? Can no, that door? obviously not. It's oh. in my office. Oh, it's, it is your office. I'm just being real nice and let little Locky use the space. <laughs> oh, thanks, Mitch. You missed friend. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, Mitch, what do you think about our house so far? That little mini potion house. Oh, where's your real house? Uh, it's over there. Okay. And that's fixed, if you can tell. No, I can't. Nah, it's not really. It's not I really have an there. island. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Jerome's got his island. You ditched his island. It's Burrow Island. Now it's just Jerome Island. It's pretty old. What? You can't drop the M. It's I didn't I didn't old. rename it. I don't know when no, this happened. No one told back. me. <laughs> oh, you got orange stain clay too? This is hype, Locky. Alright, how much space do you have? Oh, I said I'm not- oh, I'm just joking to the viewers. I'm not- Oh! Oh, okay. You can mute your mic. I'm just gonna kill Lachlan until he turns <laughs> oh, no. no, no, sorry! Sorry, <laughs> sorry, 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 Alright, alright, alright. I'm just making it nice and pretty. I need one more orange clay there to make this work. Actually, this can be the door. This can be the door. Okay, this is the door. Alright, awesome. You know, it's nice and- it's nice little design we got going here, Jerome. Do you think it's pretty cool? Oh, it is pretty awesome, dude, but- but- how much clay do you- are you sure you can build the whole thing out of clay? Yeah, I can build this whole thing out of clay. I can do whatever you want me to do. Alright, don't worry about it. Where'd you get all this hardened clay from, anyway? I, I found a mess of biomes. Pretty hot. Pretty no cool. way. Where yeah. is it? Uh, it's a while away. It's a while away, that's for sure. Uh, uh, it looks like I fun. Mm -hmm. You gentlemen enjoy your hut of Minecraft. No mm -hmm. hate, just love. I'm gonna go get stuff so that we can make cookies. What? He's a real MVP. He's a real Why MVP. Why are we making cookies? He's, why wouldn't we want cookies? Alright, Jerome, come on. Yeah. Alright, we need a door for this. We need iron doors, though, because otherwise zombies and stuff will break it out. Could you get one? They're not gonna- why would they break into a potion hut? Because we're gonna be like AFK making potions and you know trying to get the lightning on the creepers. By the way, if the lightning strikes one of those two creepers in the next like five ten minutes, we're also getting the camera. There we go. Well, I don't have any iron, do you? Um, no, I don't. Alright, here, you give me the- you go get iron from your house because it's right there. And yep. give me the stuff to make like a brewing stand. How many uh, do you okay, uh, I need cobble with the blaze rods, but I'll just uh, I'll grab a chest and I'll bring it over as well. Alright, do you have cobble? Yeah, also start getting the soul sand. Oh, we need to go for a soul sand run as well to get some uh, nice place to grow our nether warts. Wait, you didn't give me the cobble. I don't have cobble. I mean, you need to dig it. You need to dig it yourself. I don't, I don't have any... Yeah, I, I, no fishing about. I'm just saying you, you need You're going to make me make a wood pickaxe. What? Seriously? For shame. Well, I don't, have, I don't bring any pickaxes with me. Yeah, yeah, no, you're gonna need it. You're gonna need it. Don't worry about yeah, it. Yeah, you're gonna need those. Yeah, yeah. See, look, Mitch says you're gonna need 100%. it. 100. All right. So I'm gonna it's need a lot. It's three per brewing stand, right? So. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I got, I got cobble. If you need more. I'll yeah, go it. just bring the cobble. Bring right, the right, cobble. Right. I'm not a pleb. This is pleb. <laughs> this is pleb. Uh, where is my irons at, yo? Gabba gabba. I got it. All right, slick. Um, okay. So I reckon start, I'll bring some ladders, Drew. Uh, start building some sort of, uh, like, underground, like, farm for the nether warp. We're gonna need that. I'll bring the ladders to get down there, though. Um, you feel me? You yeah, I'm picking up what you're throwing down. You took too long, so I got the, uh, cobble without you. Wow. Wow. <laughs> you do that? It's... I don't know if I can record with you anymore. There we go. Six brewing stands. You want me to just put them randomly up top? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we could go high tech and build an auto brewing stand, like thick, but I honestly don't know how to do it, so we're probably not going to do yeah, that. Yeah, we'll leave that alone for now. Yeah, yeah. For we should sure. definitely do that at some point, though. Yeah, I mean, like, you only need so many potions. Like, at a point, it becomes impractical, but, like, yeah. I well, we want to go to the level of impracticality, obviously. Absolutely, buddy. Absolutely. All right. Uh, do you have a lever for me to use on the front door to like get in and out? Nope. Uh, well, that's handy as hell. Um, <laughs> that's so handy. Also, do you have any torches just to light this place up a little bit so we don't have any Drew Creeper Storms nearby? Nope. <laughs> do you have anything, Jerome? No. You told me you had everything we needed. I I, I mean like the essentials. Come on. Do you have a pickaxe? No. I have a wood one. True. <laughs> Why you do this, Jerome? No. All right. <laughs> don't tell me you got everything when you don't got everything. I mean, like, I've got like all the supplies to like make things, but that's just like the general stuff. Oh, there's an apple. I need that. Oh, baby, give me that. Give me that. I can't believe you like, like starting a new survival let's play out here, Jerome. Come on. All, all right. right. So I'm building the little thingy underneath. Yeah, yeah. 
It doesn't need much room, right? Nah, it doesn't need that much. It just needs enough so that we can have about... Depends how much soul sand we get, actually, so... Who knows? Maybe a lot, maybe not much. Just pick it up the front. Thank you, Dirk. Um, would you be able to chuck me a stick and a cobblestone? I, I only got four cobbles, so you're lucky I like you. Oh, thanks. Thanks, dude. If we need it. We need it for the doors, for our little hut. Uh, I'm not picking up what you're throwing down. Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> it went right behind me. Alright, and there's the lever. I can now come inside. Awesome. Alright, uh, so I'm going to just throw down all of these potion items in here. Um, Alright, this is my little my little area down here. Apparently we've got to bring it one more down though, to put the soul sand in. Yeah, I'd say maybe put it down a lot. Like, uh, actually, not, actually, no, that's a good height, that's a good height, um, but expand yeah. it out a little bit, you know what I mean? Oh, it's gonna, yeah, I'm gonna make it just the size of this room. Yeah, yeah, okay. No, no, so no. So, 5 by 5 25. No, 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 expand it out a little bit, I reckon. Okay. Here, let me help you with that. <laughs> Jesus, this term. Here, you go upstairs and, uh, try to sort out the brewing stands to make them look a little, I don't know, a little more neater, look a little, a little dirty right now. Or maybe put a roof What do you mean? They're perfect, there's three and three. Actually, it's not too bad, yeah. Yeah, that's a, that's a prime setup right Maybe there. Maybe work on torches, then? Because we need torches. So I don't have coal. We'll get coal. Uh, go to my house if you can, actually. Okay. I, I don't know, just if you can. Um, all yeah, right. yeah. Alright, I'm going to put a roof on our head so that we're not cooking potions in the rain, because that would be quite depressing. <laughs> quite depressing indeed. Alright, there we go. And it doesn't need to be too high. It just needs to be enough so that we're not, like, jumping up on our heads and stuff. Actually, I'd like to that. Alright. Perfect. Alright. Oh, fell off, damn it. Bottom kex are us. Do you see All the right. on the way out? Uh. I don't think so. Ooh, 64 coal. Do we need anything else while I'm at your house? Uh. That sounds about right, to be honest. Um. Alright, I'm oh, bringing the coal. Uh, some wooden stairs would work really well in this house, I reckon. I already reason. got a ton of wood, so I can give you the stairs. Okay, awesome, awesome. Uh, and then we need to sort of fix this up a little bit. We need, you need more dirt. We need to like sort of landslide the hill so it's not looking too irregular, if you know what I mean. The, okay, that's our symbol, by the way, the yellow triangle. The well, orange triangle, sorry. That's the sign of the Illuminati and sign of... It's not even the orange in real life. Lachlan and Jerome are us. <laughs> there you go. There's that. And then here's half of the coal. All right, start lighting the place up. There we go. Did you have me any wood? I gave you, uh... No. Uh, here you go. Oh! 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 What? Where's my sword? There it is. Oh, you little sandstormer. Alright, there we go. He's dead. Um, I sort of want to try and catch a creeper, though. I'm not going to lie. Um, can you light up outside as well? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Uh, Thanks, buddy. There we it's go. Yeah, this... cool. I like this place, Jerome. It's like a nice little cozy potion room, you know? Yeah, and then downstairs I have a nice little cute thingy. It'll be like 16 oh. soul sand. I, I just thought of something we need again. Um, so bring the craft table inside, I reckon. Let's just bring it all inside. You know, there's a right? craft table already inside. Oh, there is too. Okay, I didn't see that. Um, I'm going to build some furnaces because one thing we are going to need is a lot of vials. And to make vials, we obviously need um, a place to cook sand to get the glass. So either we have like a room just for burning sand or... We put it on top. What do you think? I like to keep this room just potions. So do you want to make like a furnace room two stairs down as well? Uh, sure. Do you want to go on building that? Because I don't really have any tools. I lost like everything. Yeah, no, that's fine. That's fine. Maybe... Uh, zombie with an enchanted iron sword. What do you do? Give me that sword. That does not sound good, Jerome. <laughs> this does not sound good. Um, do you have any more stairs by chance? I like this sort of system you got with these small set of stairs. This looks really cool. No, Actually, I, I don't really stairs. have any stairs. Don't worry, buddy. I got some. Um, see, so yeah, this could. I like this system. You got. Oh, it's not gonna work there. Let's I'm gonna see. put a lever on the inside of the house, just in case we get locked in. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sounds good. Sounds good. All right. Um, if I put one there, one there. That's perfect. Awesome. And then, how many stairs down did you do? Um, that's probably perfect. Put that. Can I put that in a corner? Actually, be much better if I could. Huh. I'm just waiting for the creepers to get struck by lightning. Uh, I sort of like that, though. Um, yeah, yeah, okay. Um, oh, that needs to go under the ground, though. Actually. You good in there? 
Yeah. Do you want me to go to the nether, by the way? I can go pick up the stuff for us. Yeah, that's probably not a bad shout, actually. Alright, um, cool. Does your nether portal work, or should I just go to mine? Uh, my, my nether portal works. It takes you just there to some soul sand. You should be pretty fine with it. Uh, I'm just thinking how I want to scale out this house. Um, I could just dig it one more in the ground over here. Yeah, I'll just do that. Alright, let me get this. So yeah, did you take the nether what with you, by chance? Uh, 18, yeah. Whoopsies. Uh, could you bring some back just like Yeah, I'm gonna bring it back real quick. Yeah, and then I'll hop into the nether. Yeah, yeah, buddy. Alright, sounds perfect. And then, I'm just gonna clear out this room for some Fernai. This is the Fernai room. So we got the potion level, uh, farming nether wart level, and maybe if we need to do like melons in the future and stuff like that. And then this one, which is the furnace blast room. Alright, uh... Oh, there you are. Uh, here you go. They're at the top of your stairs. Okay, awesome. Cheers. Should plant them down now. Awesome. I think they grow in just normal conditions. They don't really need light, but I don't think they work well with no light. I think it's just like general. They work with everything. As long as they have soul sand, that's all they need. Um, can I go one over on that? No, it's perfect. All right. Awesome. Add uh, you leave behind torches? No, nah, actually, I can build them. That's OG. And there we go. One Yo, your another portal's deactivated. Are you kidding me? No. Could, uh, would you be able to find flint and steel to activate it? Or you can just go on Vix. Vix should be up. Oh, um, you have a flint and steel right here. I'm going to steal that. All right, yeah. Perfect, perfect. Um, and then I'm going to need more furnaces to... What is a poisonous potato good for? Uh, nothing. Like, literally nothing. Literally nothing? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's good for nothing. Like, absolutely nothing. Do da. Da, da, da. All right, now <laughs> Jerome's mission to find the soul sand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You grab the soul sand, I'll grab the sand, and then let's quickly scoot back and try to get a couple potions brewing. What, what do you want? What are your personal favorite potions we'll start brewing um, before we wrap this up? Uh, invisibility and strength. Yeah, Usually good. Good shout. Yeah, I do need a couple of those. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to think that management-wise, we might need a bit of chests just to keep them all nice and, you know, central and stuff like that. Um, yeah, yeah, uniform. Yeah, alright. I'll just chop these trees down. Alright. And it's for every three sand, we get one potion. Oh, for every one sand, we get a potion pretty much. But you. Oh my god, that's butt cheeks. What my happened? game lagged at just the wrong time, Nothing. so I just fell. I took like eight hearts of damage, but I'm still alive. If you fell in the. <laughs> You fall in a, you know if you fall in a lava with all my nether warts? I'd have to beg Vic for nether warts. That would suck. I really don't he's, like oh, because all of them are gone already. Yeah, they'd be gone. Unless we find a new nether fortress, but that'd be pretty hard. Alright, um, so how many of these bad boys am I getting soul sands? Uh, you don't need too many. Just a 20 should do. 20 should be more than enough. Um, I'm digging out the sandbag. I feel like the biggest jag. Alright, I'm out of there. That'll do 62. Yeah, that should be enough. More than enough. Um, I'll start getting those cooking, and uh, honestly, I feel like I got a creeper real quick. Just there we go. Alright, I got 20. Seven, just in case. Nice, nice. There was no thunder and lightning on this like night, which is a little disappointing. You know what I'm saying? It's a little disappointing. I wanted to get some lightning on our creepers. Well, you said it was if you leave an AFK for a full Minecraft day, there's a 10% chance, right? No, a full actual like IRL day. Human day? It's yeah. a 10%. Oh I my! I think that's the odds Vic was telling me the other day. Like, it's it's. Rough. That's unreal. So it's not gonna happen unless we're AFK for like a week. Yeah, but when it happens, <laughs> it happens. You know. It's like when you auto-click on RuneScape, you know, you just leave it on, and then you just, one day, you pop on, you might have 99 mage, but... I don't know who would do that. I don't know, I didn't do that back in the day, I swear. <laughs> 99 mage hype. Right. Um, anyway. Uh, I hope I'm going through the right portal. I don't even know which one is yours to get back. I think you should be. Um, I just found the right portal. It'll take you back to Vix if it's the right portal. Um, this one will probably take me to the lizards, I think, Oops. if I remember. <laughs> Yeah, wow. Yeah, Dude. I got sent to the lizards again. No way. Are you serious? How did you get stuck there? I That's always get sent to the lizards. Maybe that might be like a thing. I don't know. Because you're not meant to get stuck in the lizards. Um, all right, I'm going to build these crafting tables, and we should be pretty sweet. All right, all around. Fern eyes down. And uh, now we're just going to do a little bit of remodeling, but we'll do that probably off screen or whatnot, because it's not too much of an issue. Um, let's put some of the ground as well. Uh, it's sort of like an Arnie Ewan furnace. I don't know what to do with it. Put it on the ground. <laughs> um, split these up. And... Alright, it might take me a little bit to get to you, but how's everything looking? Ah, uh, it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good indeed. I'm just getting everything cooking so we have enough uh, glass when you get home. 
And uh, yeah, it's not looking too bad at all. I'll dig these out for when you get your soul sand in here. Okay, do it. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that'll be the same roof, which it'll look a little bad, but who cares? Um, and that's a wrap, I guess. Actually, we'll bring it one more in. More nether warts. Okay, do Perfect. We might even bring it up one more. Nah, we'll leave it at that. And yeah, I guess we're good to start crafting our first lot of potions, Jerome. If oh, I'm perfect though. You ready? Um, we yeah, start start us off with it. I th I'm pretty sure the awkward potion. What do you need for that? Just to start off, you know, water bottle, just, obviously. Yeah, uh, you put in a water bottle and uh, just your general nether warts. That's how you have to start off most of your good potions. Um, you want a, a, a nether wart? Um, okay, I'm gonna put chests down in this room as well. I think. Um, so, and they won't get filled up. Well, they shouldn't get filled up. Um, let's put them there. If I can get enough. Oh, here you go, Lachlan. Oh, uh, go. Gonna drop these bits. Oh, should I just soul sand up this floor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just soul sand it up and I'll plant it down. Okay, there you go. Awesome. And place some. And here's 18 more. Look. Awesome. Yeah, if we expand and we really need it, then that's what we'll do. We only have six nether wall on us right now to make potions, but I needed to expand that out later or not. Um, later in the future. Um, okie doke, uh, let's have a look at what sand we got. Can you fetch up some of the sand down there and, uh... Sorry. Glass or sand? Uh, the glass, sorry, yeah. Leave the sand and then it cook, and, uh... I reckon... Oh, oh, that's what we need, that's what we need, that's what we need. We need a little water source, so this is a perfect location. Okay. Here's the glass for you. Oh, actually, it's gonna be a little difficult. Um, we just... You want the glass? I'll, I'll put the glass in this chest up here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Or I can make it a bottles for you if you want. Um... Yeah, that should be good. Um, would you be able to... Do you have a water, water bucket on you at all? Nah. All right, here. Uh, all right, I'm making I'm making them all into glass bottles, okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, perfect, perfect. I'm going to quickly get some there water because we need to fill it up. I, I knew there was something I was missing. It was water. All right. So all right we have 39 go. bottles, so... All right, awesome. And then what you're going to want to do... Because they're stackable now, but once you put water in, they become unstackable, which is a little obnoxious. Um, so... You just open this place up, and there's your water. So, I, is there water in there? There's no water in there. What the hell? My water just disappeared. Lol. What? Okay, I had. That's happened to me before with lava. It just literally sometimes it'll lag a little bit. And it just disappears. Yeah, yeah. Seriously, right now. All right, let's do it again. And. Okay, that was pretty freakish, I'm not gonna lie. All right, so yeah, spam click with as many bottles as you can at, at, at a point, they'll just start all falling on the ground um, if your inventory is full. There you go. Oh, we have enough just to do one round. All right, and then- it's just I threw a bunch in there. I'm just gonna throw them all in there. Yeah, yeah, awesome, awesome. All right, and then just try and- f Actually, don't fill them all in there. Um, just put them in the uh, brewing stand. So go on a brewing stand and shift click your potions or your water bottles on them. And just keep going all throughout. And I'll put- um, I'll put nether warts in all but one, because I think we want to make some different types of potions. There we go. And the rest of them I'm just going to put in these chests right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, just leave them alone. Do we have... Does it fill up the whole chest? No, we still have more. Oh. Yeah, I need, I, I'm going to go to the basement chest as well. <laughs> yeah, that's where they go pretty much. Um, yeah, because we're going to need to put these somewhere anyway. Uh, we'll put them in the downstairs chest, I guess. So let's see the first batch of potions, and then we'll wrap this up. So let's just make one of everything, and I'll try to teach you the basics. So um, let me just get my chart out. All right. Okay, so first one. Come over here, Jerome. Yeah. Uh, this potion over here. I've already put awkward potions in everything but the last one, okay? So they're all awkward potions at this stage. I'm just putting another one in there. All right, the next one, the first one, you're going to want to put... Uh, we're gonna make a speed potion, so put a uh, put a sugar in there. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. All right, mm -hmm. All right awesome. Next potion we're gonna make is a strength potion. Actually, we don't, we're not allowed to use them, but you can use them in combat situations with like bosses. So we'll make it anyway. Um, get a blaze rod and put it in a crafting table to get blaze powder. Or if we have blaze powder in there, just use that. Um, blaze powder. Perfect. Yeah, That's how you get a strength one. Is blaze powder. Sorry, yeah, yeah, it's strength. Um, so next up, regen. I don't know if we have any resources. We don't have it. It is you did guess here. here. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that one's a little uh, expensive. But uh, if you do go to the Nether and pick up a couple of those, they'll be key in PvP situations. Uh, next up, let's look at a, a fire resistance potion. So 
Uh, we have slime balls in there that I've uh, kindly donated to the, the cause. Uh, pick a slime ball out, put a blaze powder with it, probably the remaining one that you have from your blaze rod. Put them together, makes magma cream, and uh, shove that in, and you'll get a... Uh, not that there one. is magma cream, and I'll just throw that in any of these bad boys? Yeah, right throw in the third one, just to make it... Oh, uh, third or the fourth, lol. Well, you can take it to do. I did that. It's too late. No, you didn't. Did. Oh my gosh, you're bad. I did it for you, did <laughs> Okay. All right. And then, um, I'm joking. Uh, the next one is, uh, let's do a, uh, let's do a potion of healing. So this one's a little, do you know how to make it? Is that the gold carrot one? It's the, it's the, uh, the glistering melon, which is a gold watermelon. Do you have any watermelon? I don't have any on me. No, I don't got snow. Um, let me just check that chest real quick, because I might make a trip back to my house. Um, so a glistering watermelon is a gold nugget and a watermelon. Um, it's only useful in healing potions, and they'll be pretty key uh, further on. But while we're waiting anyway, uh, do you have glowstone and redstone in you? Oh, sorry, in you, on you? Uh, let me check this chest. We have redstone, no glowstone. So you need to get glowstone from your chests. Yeah, yeah, okay, I'll bring glowstone, I'll bring magma cream, I'll bring this. Oh, we can make these splash potions too if we put the, uh... Oh, yes, gunpowder, I'll bring some of that. Yeah, um, I have one gunpowder in my inventory. What was I just talking about that we need? Something I was talking about that we need it. Uh, for healing, glistening melons. That's the one, watermelon. I think I don't have any watermelon. Oh, no. Yeah, I don't have any watermelon. I swear I did. I have some in my place I can grab, or we can just leave it. Oh, here we go, I got some melon, I got some melon, I got some melon. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, I, I just never thought of just doing a melon farm, because it really makes sense. Um, yeah, yeah, we need to try and, if you could quickly, while I get there, can you just move some of the watermelon, uh, sorry, some of those water potions down to the bottom chest, just so we got space in that other chest. Wait, the water, they, oh, this one right here, you Yeah, mean? yeah, just to get some space. Yeah, yeah, cheers. Alright, and, uh, you took the watermelon. <laughs> Uh, yeah, really? Yeah. Oh, jeez. Uh, All right, bring it back up. Uh, oh, I'm glitching the stairs. There we go. Okay, I put everything back in the chest. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, you're going to take it back out anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, and that's everything. Okay, awesome. Uh, yeah. How do you pick up... Perfect. A golden carrot. Do you have gold on you, by chance? Nah. We'll have to see if it's if it's... Nuggets were fine. Anyway, uh, pick out a melon and a gold nugget. And uh, take that into any crafting grid and just put them together. And that'll make a glistening watermelon. You have to surround it, I'm guessing? No, yeah, just... you gotta surround it. Yeah. Do. Do you do? Oh, yeah, you do, you do, you do, yeah. I got the glistering melon. Okay, uh, put that bad boy in a... There we go. He's we cooking. Go. All right, let's build another one. Let's go for a potion of water breathing. This is, like, essential if you're trying to take on, like, a... Ocean Monument or something like that, so put that, uh, put a puff of fish in one of the awkward potions, pretty simple. Um, and that is pretty much the set of basic potions. The only other one is a potion of leaping, but that is a little difficult to acquire. When my rabbit farm gets better, we'll do that. Yeah, 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 that's the thing. I've only ever gotten one. Uh, I'm actually going to put another one here because it is actually that. So next thing we need for the invisibility potion, which is the big one. Uh, we're going to need a golden carrot. Uh, I have carrots in there. Can you just quickly check if it's a gold nugget or ingots that uh, you can Well, why don't we just try it out? Yeah, if it's ingots. It's probably nuggets because that's what the melon was. Yeah, it's, it's nuggets. There you go. Oh, I okay, did awesome. It. All right. Put it in the last one? Yeah, put it in the last one. And that is going to then require a... Uh, that's a night vision potion, which is all right. You're going to then need to require to put a fermented spider, which I have one there. So get that ready for that. That's one. right. I remember the, the the invisibility one was a little bit much. There was another thing to it, and that's what it is—the fermented spider eye. Yeah, these are pretty much every potion apart from a regen and a um, as like the poison ones, which is just like, eh. We might build poison in the future. It's a spider eye, um, straight after an awkward. We might build those in the future actually. What about all the weakness ones? Oh yeah, you gotta do special things with those. All right. I already got villagers, so. All right, and then the final thing is just to top it off. Uh, do you want a tier two or do you want it to have an extended tier one? Is the next choice with your glowstone and redstone? You already know that, though, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, say let's glowstone these. Yeah, that but it's, with strength. I say I normally glowstone most of them, apart from fire resistance. It doesn't matter. I think that's only redstoneable. Same with actually health is good on it too. Uh, sorry, yeah, health you want to always put glowstone. Um, and same with invis, you want that to be longer with a redstone. And yeah, 
yeah, that's pretty much water breathing. Yeah, redstone again. So that just increases how long you get to use it. But yeah, that's pretty much it, Jerome. That's like uh, most of the potions, at least. Just remember awkward nether walls, yeah. and uh, you're good to go. Awesome. Well, that was a fun episode, man. We learned a lot, and we also set up a really cool potion place that uh, we're both allowed to use. So that's hype. Yeah, that's yeah. real hype. Let's uh, let's let's. What should we call this place? I got a sign right here. What should we call it? Uh, Rocky and Jerome's Potion Hutville Manor. <laughs> wait up. Something like that. Rocky and wait up. This needs to be written down. And Jerome's. What was it? Potion Hutville Manor. We don't have enough. I'm just gonna call it Potion Hutville. Potion Hutville, yes. <laughs> It'll have to do, do, do. And done. Look, I even made it fancy. Lucky and Jerome's Potion Hutville. <laughs> Perfect. That's beautiful. <laughs> that is beautiful indeed. And wait, 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 Jerome. This is why I said we need to grab some of these. You ready? You just gotta make it here. Put some. Oh, this is gonna look so hot and spicy. Um. Can I just take some random potions from here and just use them as item frames? Please. Yeah, sure. Let's use a strength one because we're barely going to use it. And let's grab like a, a water breathing potion because again, we're barely going to use it. All right, ready? Oh, wow. Really? <laughs> like, <laughs> serious? Oh, wow. You, Jerome Pullers, it needs to be perfect. Oh, no. It looks cool now. Can't say it doesn't look swaggy as hell. Oh, that's hype. Okay. I just hope no one steals it. Yeah, look, there won't be hopefully any rude sandstormers. That's, you can hope, we can pray. We can yeah. pray. All right. Well, I hope you guys did enjoy this episode of How to Minecraft, teaching Jerome how to use the potions and make the potions in Minecraft. If you guys did, be sure to leave a like rating below. And uh, yeah, I guess uh, we'll see you guys sometime in the future for more episodes of How to Minecraft. See you guys. Yeah. Later. Peace out, everybody.